You are now tuned in with movie review with Imperial. Today's movie review. Today's movie review is Justice League. Now, if you a fan of DC comics, you've been watching uh, how they doing the superhero movies compared to Marvel movies. The Man of Steel, when they re did Superman, it was a good film. They came back with. Batman vs. Superman was doo-doo. The plot was weak. Got a lot of bad reviews. They came out with Wonder Woman. A lot of storyline, but it was a good, in my opinion, was a good movie. Now this brings us to Justice League. So... Had a lot of action in the film. Stephen Wolf was the main villain in this film. It gave you some feedback on the characters Aquaman, Flash, and the Cyborg. Gave you some type of feedback. However, I believe that it's kind of missing something. I don't like the way that they brought Superman back to life. That seemed real bogus to me. So I don't, uh, I don't like the way how they brought Superman back to life. Overall, the story was okay. Um, they did when start Superman did come back. He did wreck shop so i liked it that that they made him uh super strong and didn't have him come back weak ben affleck playing batman ben affleck didn't do a bad job uh in my opinion he's the third best batman to ever do it first is christian bell just was a head case, but I think Christian Bell played Batman the best. Second was Michael Keaton in the very first Batman movie, way back with Jack Nicholson as the Joker. And then you got Ben Affleck, so it wasn't that bad. I'm hearing there's an Aqua movie, Aquaman movie that's coming out, so that should be interesting. So you get some backstory on Aquaman. His, his character, uh, he did well. Wonder Woman was one of them. I think she does great. Flash was like, Flash, the, the, the actor that played Flash or the character of Flash reminds me of the same type of character as the last Spider-Man that came out. Spider-Man um, Homecoming. They got the same type of uh, character or whatever. So I, you know, you're going to like it or you're not. Overall, Justice League for the first one uh, was was okay. Better than, definitely better than Batman versus Superman, but it didn't get, it didn't do it all for me. There's also two post-scene credits at the end of the movie. And my four-star rating process, I'm going to give this movie two point five out of four stars. Two point five out of four stars for a superhero villain movie, in my opinion. Stay tuned to the next time with Movies Reviews with Imperial.